blinds, blind ball back. No way. No way. Guess who my were you? An idiot. No way is that a pen. Tonight was Newcastle United's final match played before the time we are derby. A season defining match on Saturday. If we lose that game, that's it. The season is over and we will never hear the end of it. It will be a disgrace and embarrassment for us to not even just go to a game, just waking up on a daily basis, go to work, go to college, go to school. You will be among Sunderland fans who will mock, mock us. <laughs> we can't lose that game now. It is ridiculous. Uh, Liverpool won 4-2 tonight. However, in the match, they accumulated XG expected goals of 7.56. That is actually the highest in Premier League history when XG has been recorded. So it's essentially say that Liverpool should have scored seven to eight goals against Newcastle in the game. However, do take into consideration the fact they had two pens in the game, that will heavily increase the XG. It would be would have been around the five mark without the pens, which is still a high amount. That's not my problem. The problem is now we have lost seven and eight games. We lose the Sun that's eight losses in nine. Now I said this before the Liverpool game. If we lose that Sunderland game, we've got City afterwards, Villa afterwards, let's just be negative for a moment and see we lose all the games. That's 10 losses, 11 game. You've got a point finger somewhere. Someone's got to go at that stage. You can't afford to lose that many games in a row. It's not sustainable. It's not tenable. We lose that many games. We are in the, the mud. We've got to pull it back against Sunderland. I don't want to say this, but... A draw wouldn't be the worst thing in the world and take the game back to St James Park, but you've got to not lose the game. You've got to be honestly going out and, and, and picking up the result. You've got to win the game. So yeah, that's the warning message now. We'll talk about the Liverpool game at the end. We're going to show you the floor. We're going to show you all the fan bits, all the uncut raw footage. Uh, I got extremely uh, annoyed with the Jota situation. So we're going to show you all the uncensored, uncut footage. So there's your warning now. It will be uh, foul language in the video for me. Uh, apologies, I don't do it much, but I did lose my cool a little bit for the referee. But yeah, uh, I guess enjoy it. But just soak it in. I'll come back to this at the end and then we've got that game on Saturday. I'm enjoying it, man. I'm enjoying it. I was just gone. Yeah, I took it. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, so it's got to go on the left here now. Anfield, as I mentioned, in Joe, haven't worn here since 1994, and oh, I'm a boy for this one. I'm always there. He is. He's excited for the game. Come on! There we go. That's what I want to see as manager before the game. You come on, get you come on. <laughs> Let's go put in Mendo. Let's go put in Mendo.
Side goal at 30 seconds there, we literally just give away a pen. It's, it's obvious pen, like I can see from the other pen. So, so bad for us. It's his final time before the break. Come on, come on, oh. come on, oh it's mighty, come on, come on, boom, yes, yeah! oh he's flagged, he's flagged off size, he's flagged, he's flagged off size, oh he, Miley must have been off size, he's flagged off for Miley hasn't he, oh go and get ball in lad, he's playing it short, Good half, good half, most like. Liverpool fans are happy with the referee. You've got to be honest with the referee, he's been bad for both teams. I'll have to give a verdict. But yeah, there's a half progress more for the Castle. Actually, had a better game. Caught the referee of Mank. I don't like him. Well, half time at Anfield, Liverpool with Newell, Newcastle with Newell. I tell you what, that was a good half of us. The game progressed more. Newcastle actually got into the game a lot. Liverpool definitely should have scored. Obviously, the Pender should have scored. Salah, bad miss from him. Newcastle still done well. To be fair, to Banka, a uh, very good game from Debanka. Newcastle have done well. They're keeping that fair. And, I mean, as the game's well up, but Liverpool have started to get rattled. I think Newcastle have grown into the game quite well. We've got to have a good 45. Yeah, I definitely think it's a winnable game here. Yeah. Uh, take a draw any day in the week, but I honestly think that Newcastle have a good display here. Yeah. We we'll score early on. I think the game can potentially be won here. Yeah. So it's a big half coming up. Um, I, I don't know why the Liverpool fans are booing the referee at the end of the half. I, I agree the referee's not had a good game, but listen. They should have scored their own and caught Had a good couple of one on ones. They should have scored their pen. They've already got themselves to blame. But for most, good half. Now 45 to go. Let's keep on it, lads. We've got a potential, potential of a big result here. So let's keep it up. Uh, I've been very impressed so far. Who's, who's that then? It's Dan Burns Slider. Where, where is he? Where, where is he then? 
was a solid play for him. They had so much space. Darwin, who has got about 20 yards there, it's just... Oh, you're, you're kicking yourselves, that's such a poor goal. Come on, come on. Staff all was to try to get in a pen for you, second third and all gold and this decision making for once again. It's disappointing because we've done so well yeah. Uh, it's 3 1 now and a couple of lads to start the goal. Uh, I, mean, I mean why can't we do this against a crap team? To do this against a crap team will be fine but the problem is we've had a good performance and against the best team in the league who hadn't been able to do enough. But, I mean, to be honest, I think I deserved it. The great quite a lot. They gave a good go, but they were probably just having better. Yes! Come on! Oh, game on! We're not back in down the day, like... Come on. Uh, class goal from Botman there, uh, keeps the game alive. Come on. But he can't sort of for a match, let's give, let's give him one. Oh, he's came through. Fuck off! No way! Boo! Fuck off, man! You blind, blind, bold bastard! No way! Get some air, what are you? Fucking idiot. No way is that a pen. Unbelievable. Right, well, he's got a second penalty there. Did he score this one? You miss it, miss it again if I give another pen on this ref. Referees like him going the gear is so crap, man. So shit. Okay. Oh, he had to go again. Is he going to get a hat trick against her? No, oh, the block. But oh. now it's going to stay at four. Well, that's that. I you know, match for the derby. Nose of the flating end, but I don't think it was that bad. Full time 4-2, I'm back in the hotel room and correction. I didn't think the first Liverpool pen was a pen either, but Salah missed anyway, so that one didn't matter too much. But the second one, that's one of the worst dives I've honestly ever seen. How VR has not came in to help the referee there, I would never know. He's clearly made a mistake and VAR has not helped the guy out. That is VAR's job. It is a clear and obvious error. And would Newcastle have got a result from the game if that was reversed? More likely not, but you can't physically prove that. The extra, the amount of shots to ours, doesn't matter. Newcastle could have potentially got an equaliser from that moment onwards. We just don't know. Um, we can't prove that. It's all one that's done with now. But we, we can't see way too many chances didn't work. It was a good, what, 32, 33 shots Liverpool have. And that's just not good against any team now. Uh, it's tricky because, well, uh, Eddie Howe comes out the press come and says that Callum Wilson's injury says that Kieran Trick is injured. Trust me, we'll get to them in a different video. But, yeah, we've got so many injuries now. Uh, we've managed to thankfully get out of this match with all our players in the squad that played. Uh, no suspensions, no injuries, so... The players are all played and they should be playing against Sunderland. You've got to be better. 
it's that simple. I'll send you an intro. I'm not going to keep banging on about it in this video, but that's the one. That is the one you can't lose. You lose that game, it's over. It is well and truly over. Tonight's over and done with this. I'm forgetting about it. You know, I'm going to forget about this tomorrow. It's it's over. It's get out of my head. We we'll move on now. Huge, huge game on Saturday. Turn up for that one. Or else.